Aquarius, come on, put your feet up, make yourselves at home. My name is Jen Dawson, welcome to Jed TV. All right, Aquarius, I've been thinking about it. I've been meditating on it. And the words that come up for you are missed opportunity. Well, all right then, let's have a look, shall we? What have you got for Aquarius, please? From the dear universe. And this missed opportunity. Bear in mind, my love, these are general readings, so it's not going to resonate with all of you, but if it does, take a look in the description box below. There's a link to my Patreon if you want to watch extended videos. There's also a link to my website if you would like to book a private reading. There's a lot of scammers out there, so the only way you're going to get a legitimate private reading with me is if you click that link in the description box below. Go to gentvtarot.com and book a reading. I'm never going to come to you. I'm not going to be in your emails or your DMs or down there in the comments below. That's a scammer. It's not me. You've got to come to me. Missed opportunity for Aquarius. Oh, something's coming in, I'm getting a really itchy face. I don't know what that's about. It just happens when I'm tuning in. I get a really itchy face. like you guys rushed things a little bit the overall vibe we've got is the page of cups in reverse and the cause of it is the knight of swords now pages are about communication but then again so are knights and i sort of feel like It's like a block was put on this by this other person. It's like, I kind of feel like they, they blocked moving forwards with you emotionally with, with being a cups because things were going too fast. They just, nope, nope, can't do this. That's kind of what I'm feeling. Things were moving too fast. Why is the Seven of Swords here in reverse? <sighs> it's, uh, I mean, this is what, what you need to know now. Sorry, that's my dryer going off. I sort of, I, I feel a lot of anxiety, to be honest. I feel, I feel a lot of anxiety in trying to find ways, trying to not feel that anxiety, trying to release it, trying to let it go, trying to, but also at the same time, not just for yourself, for the other person in question. Yes, yes, sorry, we were we were rushing things. I don't mean to rush things. You're kind of trying to help them, not feel such anxiety, talk to them about it, you know. I just think it's kind of falling on deaf ears. I, I, I feel like you're, you're saying, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to rush things. I, I, I just, I really like you. I don't mean to push it too far. I care about you, but I, I feel like it's falling on deaf ears. I feel like they're kind of, they're, they're, they're blocking you getting through emotionally. Anything else? They're not ready. 
they're not ready for things to move forward they're not ready for they i kind of feel like if they've, they've put these blocks up i feel like that's kind of cutting communication but um they're just trying to protect themselves they're not talking to you right now because they're just trying to avoid feeling the way it felt when things were going too fast it's just self-preservation i feel is is what they're kind of doing what they're going through all right moving forward so what's coming up in the near future we've got strength in reverse What you want is a relationship with this person. What you're gonna get, it's not, you're not going to get what you desire with this person. I kind of feel like in the near future, you're gonna be like, well, you know, I did my best, I tried my hardest. It's time to give up. The best you can hope for, three of cups. That's a celebration card, that's cool. feel like that's them being happy for you when you meet someone else is that crazy they're not ready no I, I, I really do feel like the best you can hope for with this person is when you do move on you'll probably get a call from them saying mate that's brilliant I'm really glad to hear that you're happy. I just don't think they can offer this to you. You in in the near future have got judgment reverse. This is you kind of I I don't want to look at myself. This is uh, what I'm hearing is you don't want to look at why you pursue. This is not the first time you've done this, I feel like. Why you pursue people who push you away. You don't want to look at that. Tell me more. Now, if you were to look at that, it could be pretty good. It could change things for you really significantly. You have a huge change in the patterns that you keep following in your life. If you keep falling for unavailable people, there's got to be a reason. So not taking a look at you and why that is a pattern in your life, where it comes from, that can be That could be something that keeps replaying patterns in your life. I uh, I like to do meditations. There's a channel called Jen Peters. She's an Australian lady. She's really great. Um, she does these inner child healing meditations. It might be good for you to take a look and see uh, what resonates with you. But there's something you need to look at that you're avoiding looking at. It's about time. Them. I see that you guys are going to talk again, but I think, how are you going to talk? Is them saying, I'm really happy for you. You're moving on. That's great. What card just flew out? Temperance. Yeah, I think that you're going to... You're going to get communication. I've got two cards of communication here, but another card of them, it's the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. They're not ready. They're, they're, there's an imbalance. They're not balanced enough to have a relationship with you at this time or at that time. Now, the outcome here is the Ace of Wands in reverse. Aces in reverse, I see as obstacles in the way, blockages. There are too many obstacles in the way to you having a relationship with this person. Sorry. My light went down a bit. I 
you sort of see the Ace of Wands as well as... I don't think they have much motivation towards having a relationship with you. But I think they want you to be happy. Yeah, as I'm saying, I think they want you to be happy. They do. They really want you to be happy. I just think that not with them, you know. I'm going to take this into extent. I'm going to ask about them. I'm going to ask, where are you in this person's heart space? What are their intentions towards you? What do they want to say to you? And some guidance from the universe. But let's... The end of a tough cycle approaches. Bonza. That's amazing. I actually really am happy about that. It's about time, eh? Yeah. <laughs> did some exercise today. My mom's like, girl. It was, did arms, lots of prongs. Not the right time. Who knows? Down the road could be just not now and your song of the day is I see your face every time I dream on every page every magazine it's photographed by Def Leppard total tune don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell. And if you want to watch extended, take a look in the description box below. There's a link to my Patreon. You'll find the video there. See you later.